This is the the game where we try to guess the top ten movies by domestic box office gross of the summer. Now, let's get to number three, Jermaine Lucier. Your number three movie. I feel the need, the need for speed. <gasps> Top really? Gun. No, no way. No, no way. way. No way. No way. You guys, yeah, no you way. guys don't know. Oh, man. Yeah. You know what? I'm, the champ is speaking. Let me uh, give me the mic. Uh, wow. <laughs> wow. I mean, look, it's like. You think it's we... going to make more money than Thor? This is. Yes. yes. Uh, this is madness. I think, it's go- I think is it is going to be. Multiverse a beast, of madness. A beast. Yeah. I mean, you talked, we talked about multi generational things. Top Gun goes back way even further than Jurassic Park. And it's a movie that Paramount is so confident in. They've just been holding it and holding it. And yeah, that, a lot of that is Tom Cruise and his powers of Scientology. But I just have this feeling that the movie is going to be that nostalgic, amazing, uplifting, rah-rah, Americana, even if you don't care about Americana movie. And uh, yeah, I think it's just going to be uh, a, a monster. And uh, yeah, I mean... My, my, that's I a thought, bold move. Yeah, so it's a, yeah. It, it is. I didn't honestly didn't think it was that bold of a move, but uh, I'm I'm actually kind of glad because mm. if we want to go down, I'm going to go down in flames like Goose. <laughs> top Gun yeah, is it, one of those it's movies. It's a bold move like what Goose yeah. did in the first Top Gun. <laughs> that worked out really <laughs> well. Yeah, maybe. You, maybe you think the that's going to make more money than Lightyear, which is in yeah. yeah. family? Let's not yeah. spoil the rest yeah. of the list. Yeah, yeah. I will yes. say this: that this movie is not even in my top five. Oh my god! Well, not in my top five either. Same, same. This is Jermaine's last stand. Um, this is, Jermaine, you know, months from now when we're talking about how you lost, this is the moment. This it is might how be. it happened. It might very, it might very well be, but if it's I'm almost down, like, like a, said, it's like he's a maverick. Okay. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> yeah. There it is. All right. Well, is. that's Jermaine's number three choice. It's Top Gun Maverick. Okay. Let's get to uh, Davindra's top number three. Uh, I think you had already said Thor: Love and Thunder, right? Yeah, Thor. Thor. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. It's gotta be Thor. It's gotta be it's Thor. Gotta be Thor. Yeah, you would have to be completely <laughs> mentally maladjusted <laughs> mad, to, not choose, mad to not choose those three movies as your top three. And you guys, but I think we, you're you're crapping on me, and I appreciate it. I can take it, no problem. <laughs> but you think about like I still think I think will will kids show up opening weekend? No. Was it going to make two hundred million dollars every weekend? No. But like the Mission Impossible movies do a huge. I, they do two hundred two hundred million. They yeah. have yeah, yeah, they have yeah. never cracked like two fifty million. It wouldn't be up there. Yeah. yeah. I think all three of these movies, uh, Jurassic World, Thor, and Doctor Strange. Top I think Gun. All, oh, sorry. I think, all, <laughs> <laughs> I think all three of these movies could break $400 million. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's possible. That's fine, but when Top Gun does five, you guys are going to be kicking yourself. <laughs> can, you imagine, um, can you imagine? Jeff, let's, let's hear your number six. I'm very curious if it, is, if it is Top Gun Maverick. Top Gun Maverick at number six? Yep. Nope. Oh, oh shit. Nice. I broke the I like cycle, it. Jeff. I like that one though. Jeff Kanata, you're number eight. This is where it should be. <laughs> Not gonna make more than number eight money. This is where it is going to be. 